in this video we are going to discuss about clustering a network topology as we already discussed about creating a network topology now we'll be looking into it practically about the clustering of the network topology and how to uncluster them as well so if you can see here this is the present network topology which i have created so that it is very clear that here uh, pc is connected to a switch and the switch is connected to two servers which are server 0 and server 1 and later on it is connected to 2901 router 0 and router 1 connected to the wireless router with to the pc here so here you can choose one network device which is 1941 router and you can see this is in the on state now so you can create a, a cluster by choosing one or more devices so select this 1941 router 3 and you can create a cluster how you can create a cluster you have to click create new cluster or shift u here so you see here this cluster 0 is created and now you wanted to uncluster this one so you have to click on this delete icon so that it will ask you to delete yes you have to click before deleting it will ask you do you want to uncluster the components or delete the entire cluster so it will give you a prompt about uncluster so you have you have to choose uncluster so that it is clear that again it has come out of that cluster so you see now how to create a cluster and how to delete it now we will see how to connect clusters and also arrange the connections between the different routers so you see here now again we are going to create a cluster for 1941 router 3 so the cluster is now created so we wanted to connect 2901 router 1 and 2901 router 0 to this cluster so as we know about the connections we maximum use automatically choose connection type but now here you cannot use because if you choose this connection type also it will give you a prompt that auto connection is not applicable for clusters that means you cannot choose auto connection here so what we have to do it's clear that you have to select it manually so how you will select you will select serial DCE now you see you have to connect this 2901 router 0 to cluster 0 and also from 2901 router 1 to cluster 0 so for that we are breaking the connection between router 0 and router 1 that you are deleting by using this delete option and now you wanted to connect the router 0 to cluster and from cluster it has to connect to the router 1 so you see under cluster you see only 1941 router so here you cannot select as we saw that auto connection is not allowed so we are taking copper straight through and connecting it manually to gigabit ethernet 01 to console port which is router 4 gigabit 0 slash 0 in the same way again choosing copper straight through to connect from cluster which is router 4 gigabit ethernet 01 to 2901 router 1 to gigabit ethernet 01 so this is how we connect the outside routers into one of the clusters that means in the network topology if you want to join a cluster so how to create a cluster and how to uncluster and delete how to arrange the cluster you can see clearly this cluster 0 arranging the cluster into the network topology and connecting clusters between the network topology so it is very clear now this is the network topology which we used to have but now we have created a new cluster called cluster 0 with 1941 router and in that we have created a connection between 2901 router 0 from one of its gigabit ethernet interface to cluster router 4 interface and from cluster router 4 interface to 2901 router 1 interface so this is about the 
the custom creation of a cluster in the network topology and how to create them arrange them in an order uncluster them before deleting the cluster and also deleting the cluster and connecting the clusters it is very important in the network topology so this is about the present topic